Hi, this is Anil and welcome to the video tutorial for the learning lad on C++ programming. So in this tutorial, we're going to learn you know, how to give an alternative name for the namespaces in C++ or you know the namespace aliases in C++. Alright, here you know for the demonstration purpose, what we're going to do is we're going to um, create a namespace. For that, you know, we need to use the keyword namespace and then the namespace name and let's say very large namespace name you know a very large name here and then uh, you know we're just gonna create a property and let's call it as int x and then uh, you know we're gonna have a nested namespace and uh, for that we need to use the keyword namespace and let's call it as um, nested namespace and here you know we're just gonna define a function and let's call it as display you know void display and it's just gonna use you know we're just gonna print out the value of x so i'm gonna use c out and i'm gonna refer x all right now you know we have defined a namespace in our program and we have defined a nested namespace inside that uh, outer namespace all right we can uh, declare alternative names for the namespaces so here we can do that by using the keyword namespace namespace and then we need to give the new name so here you know for this very large namespace name i just gonna say one and then equal to namespace name to which we want to give the new name so here i want to give the name for this namespace so i'm gonna copy that and paste it here and that's it now we can uh, refer to the members defined in this very large namespace name you know by using this one so here you know i'm going to use one and then the scope resolution operator and then you know i can access the nested namespace or you know the member x i'm going to access the member x and i'm going to initialize this one to a value let's say uh, 100 and then i'm going to call this display function for that i can use this one you know the new name and then the nested namespace and then the scope resolution operator and then the display all right i'm gonna build and run this and you know we get 100 now you know we can give the new name for this nested namespace also so let's say namespace and nested you know the new name equal to uh, I can refer the outer namespace by using the new name one. So I'm gonna write one here, and then the scope resolution operator, and then nested namespace. So I'm just gonna copy this and paste it here. And now we can refer this by using nested. And then if I build and run this, you now we get hundred. So this is it guys this is about a short video tutorial on you know defining a new name for the existing namespaces in C++. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next tutorial.